I believe that fairy tales, mythology and old tales, they all contain a seed of the truth, manipulated through the generations and time, many probably lost and hidden, unknown to generations of our times. Giants and titans used to abide this realm and their existence is not possible to deny. There is far too many examples in this world, hidden under mainstream dishonesty about their real identity. Petrified titans, giants, animals and plants like enormous trees, that clearly have been destroyed on purpose. They are right there in front of us. For instance the Naka cave meaning the snake cave in Thailand has been recently discovered to contain more and more snake characteristics, so hard to hide and manipulate. In result the site has been closed to the public and is no longer accessible. This cave is being portrayed as a cave that resembles the petrified snake. If we are being told over and over again that something looks like something that it actually is, most people won't question the truth. This cave is in fact a petrified snake or similar reptile. It doesn't just remembers it by accident nor it is a coincidence, that it looks the way it does. Nature doesn't play games with us, is the people who don't want us to know the truth about this world. What do we know about the cave? The cave has many rock formations that seem to suggest the mouth and teeth of a large serpent-like creature. Over past few years more and more elements of the cave are being discovered which makes it more and more difficult to pretend this is not a real snake. There are formations of the teeth, skin like folded hanging skin, snake shredded skin including the folds, texture and size. The cave is located below the viewpoint hence is not visible from above, being hidden under the trees. Doesn't that sound like a perfect resting place for a snake? The cave is situated in the region of Buang Khan. And do you know what else is this area known for? For three large mountain rocks, that just so happened, look exactly like petrified whales. They are in fact called the three whale rocks, often described as whale parents with their child whale. Has nobody ever questioned and examined those rocks? They look exactly like past living being that has been petrified and remains in perfect condition. It even shows a petrified flesh of those whales, could not get any more real. The fact those whales would be swimming in such cute family goop is absolutely normal for whales. These whales are not a coincidence, it is a proof that petrification has occurred in this area without any doubt. Furthermore being so close to border with Laos there is a picture circulating the internet with very visible petrified reptilian head from Laos. The picture has been wrongly described as snake cave in fact it is entirely different location, yet so close to the snake cave in Thailand. Another giant petrified snake just round the corner? Snakes and serpents have a lot of meaning in local culture and tradition. Snakes were often associated with been seen as guardians or spiritual portals, and they have long been associated with power and strength. In 1970 the cave location was discovered, driving tourism into the area. In 1987 Dr. Shalong Kanjanavanik, who was a prominent archaeologist and professor of physical sciences at Shurinari University of Technology in Thailand. 
He ran an excavation project in Naka Cave and was examining there, what was described, as the largest snake scale in the world. Later in 2014 an Australian reporter came to Thailand in order to investigate the ongoing mystery of Naka Cave. They ended up finding thousands of giant snake scales all over the cave. They were found in many different colors, but most importantly, they were all authentic. It turns out that when the snakes shed their skin, they left a part of themselves behind. Moreover the mind-blowing discovery has been made, when the UK and Thai team were excavating around the cave, they found a sacrifice chamber, with 1,000-year-old sculpture of a snake, measuring 150 centimeters. It has been brought to Thailand's Golden Triangle Museum near Chiang Rai, where it will be preserved for future generations to come. This has been kept quiet until 2017, where Dr. Sari Pongpanik, an archaeologist who visited the site, he told reporters that he had never seen anything like it before, and that it was obviously not recent, according to Bangkok Post. Hundreds of publications have been published over the years spreading false information about Naka Cave. But why can the truth just be made transparent? People are hiding the truth about the forefathers of humanity, our ancestors, the giants who roamed the earth as recalled in the religious and ancient texts of the world. Having knowledge on the existence of these creatures changes a lot in our perspective, bringing us closer to God. Furthermore driving humanity closer to the Creator takes away power and control for those evil groups. Many believe that giants were indeed present before the big flood of Prophet Noah. Perhaps that's what insinuated the worldwide petrification of all sorts of living creatures. That is why we don't hear about those discoveries, they are being kept quiet and manipulated into traditional tales or simple miracles made by nature, that nobody will ever question. What do you think about Naka Cave? Does it resemble the giant snake or is it in fact a giant snake fossils? Comment below and make sure to hit subscribe button for more conspiracy and facts about this world. Bye for now.